Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet-looking couple like you. How much? Cloud! <laughs> Just give me a holler when you change your mind. Hold on. Let me look at the guy first. No preferences we can't accommodate. No, sir. Accommodations. You know, I've heard from more than a few people that my son Johnny has been roaming the streets of Walmart. Before he leaves town, I need to make sure I deliver him his lucky pillow. I have faith in my boy, of course. But a growing man needs plenty of sleep. Sleep of good quality, no less. That's how mind and body stay healthy and active. In other words, this pillow is crucial to his health. <laughs> Right up, step right up. It's the fully automated, state of the art item procurement machine. Maybe it's broken? Any item you can think of, just a... Help? 
You know, huh? What's that? Not working, you say? Huh. Well, maybe there's something right. wrong with the wiring. Step right up, step right up. It's the fully automated, state-of-the-art item procurement machine. We stock other stuff, too. Thanks a bunch. most delicious and delectable honey you've ever tasted. It's no secret, really. It's okay to tell Hey, I'm talking to you. I said they're good. Try one. Cloud, I will go wherever my research leads me but the success of my endeavors rests entirely upon you. Your assistance would be much appreciated. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? You will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Oh, 
man and dog. Got that right. Where did they get off treating us like we're not even here? Can you believe the boss breathing? Hold it. Best to steer clear of this alley. You may not like the people you find down here, and they may not like you. Do you give any thought to what you want to do next? I want to open my own place, but the competition is pretty... We're cool though. Just blowing off work is all. We're not up to anything. Honest. We just want a second away. To relax. This alley's like a sanctuary for us. You should see it in the daytime. Empty. Hold it. Best to steer clear of this alley. You may not like to give any thought to what you want to do next. This is full up too. They call themselves bankers, but they're just little sharks and sights. Huh? What? Hey, you think that guy's doing okay? He wasn't looking so hot, you know. Maybe we should go check on him? But this street, isn't it? The one that everyone says is bad news? Shit, you're right. I don't want to go down there now. Hey, bro, this ain't no place to hang out. You feel me? Ain't nobody gonna give a shit if you get your throat cut here. <laughs> what happened with you know what? Aren't you a curious cat, walking dark alleys? You've got balls, so I'll give you a pass. This once. Wait, you don't mean the newbie too, right? I said deal with it. Can't have this coming back on Sam or the Dawn. I understand. You didn't see or hear anything. You get me? <laughs> My, what lovely weather we're having! Oh. No? Hmm. They call huh? themselves bankers, but they just know the sharks and suits. I think this is where they said to me, isn't it?
Welcome to the world of tomorrow. Any so item you can hear. I sworn it was in my pocket. Get your delicious material pops right here! Yes, right here! With dozens of flavors to try, including a mystery ones! Hey there. Are you looking for anything in particular today? The 
There's a new place where I'm bad girl I'm much younger than me. One more. Come on. I'm fine. Only a select few even know of them. But hands down, it's <laughs> Hey, you hear about that real narrow street just over there? You're not still wasting your gill at the Honeybee Inn, are you? <laughs> you bet I am. Found me a secret route in, one nobody don't know about. Only trouble is, it's filled with drunks and garbage. Are you sure about this, man? Corneo's gonna use and abuse you. Of course you would, sure. Then let's do something about it. Trust me, I would if I could. Guy over there, he uh, he doing all right, you think? He's fine, just drunk, like the rest of them. Am I right? That candy that comes with the summoning materia ice cream. Uh, that scent. I can't stand it. How about a trade? I'll give you three Bahamas. Apologies, sir. We are not ready to open at this time. Aren't you that leaf house? Uh, hey! What the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? Uh, well, if you must know, I've wanted to be a dancer ever since I was a little girl. I come here at night to live the dream. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. Gotta stay sharp, though. Lifetime bands are lifetime bands. As if you're not here to... Boys. Oh gosh, 
My heart is racing. Marlita's the greatest honey girl there ever was. It's an undisputed truth, and I dare anyone try and deny it. Guess who got my insurance? It's always best to be prepared for the worst, wouldn't you agree? Quality monster insurance is more essential than ever these days. No, no way! You've lost your marbles, man! My marbles are secure, sir. Tis you who are crazy. I'm so excited to find you see Andrea's show. wrong with this place. in this part of town so many finds yeah anything good
ever been done to me my sweet sweet madam m i'm a customer The sweet embrace of pretty ladies? Oh, that's what I need. Machine records a while back, but I'm still looking for my first big hit. It's been seven years now. Not easy, but you gotta do what you love. And I love to sing. This is a new song of mine. Maybe it'll be that number one. I love it. You got the voice of an angel. Dig a hole and throw me in. I'm already dead. Leave me alone. I'm nothing but a hollow shell of a man without my inspiration. Drinks are on me.
Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. Do come again. They came this close to turning all that ordinance loose. Can you blow us all the hell in that? I'd kill to get my hands on Shindos, Romica. <laughs> now that's a shit. I think we might have found our man, and he's a gaudy one. Yeah. so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. 
If you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. If you're hell-bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope.
Hey there, friend. Grab a seat. Any seat that's open. So, what will it be? Made a little extra. I want to spend it on some good eating. Um, what's the best? If you want a recommendation, try the recommended special. Hey there, friend. Grab a seat. Any seat that's open. What about that barbecue I'm cooking? Who says I can't eat both? Why is it daily a special platter? What were you thinking? Stupid, stupid, stupid! Crawl into a hole and die! Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram! Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Pretty, please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Cornell will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. Tails. Ed, you lose. <laughs> hey, don't look so blunt. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, and not just the Mio. Now let's get daddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? <sighs> Trick coin. I had a hunch. Cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. I guess they're closed right now? I feel rejuvenated and alive! Oh, God 
damn tourists. Is this the place? Oh, supposed to go down like this. Think so. Uh, I just wanted Let to me see handle Andrea. this. Curse you wait out here, we okay? Will, then why would I do that? Not. No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Good evening. Oh. Hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh. We don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? But Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Hey, are you nervous too? You bet I am! This You're not here to talk to the honey boys. This must be the place. Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm -hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don Glover. Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Uh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Mm. 
Hmm. Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? Well then, it should go without saying that you get what you pay for. All four fingers at once, quick and to the point. <clears throat> Little rough. Hmm? They can stop at any time if it's too much to handle. <laughs> Try flexing the muscles. You'll feel the difference. Hmm? Loose and limber. Am I right? Actually, yeah. Hmm. How was it? It's all right, I guess. What are you doing? Flexing. Flexing. Uh, never mind. Hm. Think you'll make a habit of it? <sighs> All right, then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So, tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm... Okay. Really? But you cannot go dressed like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's all right, I guess. <laughs> oh, you. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. 
because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. There any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. ourselves into nothing good I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town think we can win it all that's one thing I'm definitely sure of I agree she the confidence just don't get too cocky okay at the moment, but I'll see what I can do. Have a safe trip. Everybody knows I've got the best Coliseum souvenirs around. And when I'm open for business, you can buy some. What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? Team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. All right, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. This is gonna be so much fun! You lost? This is for spectators only. Our dark horse is dead for sure. This check-in is for spectators only. Just calm down, will ya? does this thing go you think I wonder how many people are fighting hey you're not nervous are you nope really you're even more quiet than usual just trying to focus like you should Oh, 
Or really and utterly, viciously, without mercy. Until they vomit black. Only the most ruthless fighters, the savages, still standing here at the end, shall claim the skill and the glory. And now, the long awaited adventure with the Blood Star Beast will battle for your amusement. Hit the corner! Warriors of every shape and size will fight to the death before your very eyes. In tonight's Cornell Time! This place is really something. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you again. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know. So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well, I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aaron, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. Never been more scared in my entire life. It's a gift from Don Corneo. Drink it, and they say you'll be raring to go for hours on end. If I had, maybe things would have gone differently for me. Maybe you should. It's yours if you want. How is it? It's thick. But you like it so much you couldn't possibly share, right? You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We're in for 
a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this brutal contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink. Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now! Team. Hmm. What's wrong? The rules don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. You've got some time before your next match. Get some rest. That's what they call beginner's luck, but the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semifinals, first in their first date with death, I present the lucky couple! We're like our lucky for the rest of us! Give it up once again for Cloud and Eren! Couple my ass! What the hell you two trying to pull? You assholes cost me a fortune! Yeah, yeah! They're about screamers in this trap yard. Thieves and killers through and through. Two criminal for common criminals. The worst of the worst! Ladies and gentlemen, check your pockets, because they may have already robbed you blind! The most contemptible son of bitches inside of Walmart market, Bex Benefits! Yeah! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! It's those guys! It's those guys! Look, look! Hot damn! They've been sitting to feed you two of your just desserts! Yeah! So we'll quiet, because we're going to serve up a heap of help! Hey! What does just desserts taste like? Huh? Like justice! Oh, like yeah. baby! Uh, what? <laughs> and who are these unscrupulous looking gentlemen? It would seem that there are actually eight members of Beck's badasses. Hey, that's cheating! The only rule here is that there are no rules! Yeah! If Corneo says it's okay, you gotta suck yeah. it up! Yeah. The dogs have branded his approval! This is ridiculous! The 
Yes! Overwhelmingly stacked against it. This could be a real bloodbath. So I implore you, ladies and gentlemen, don't look away, or you may miss the best part. The second match of the Corneo Cup semifinals begins wow. now! I did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. <laughs> so have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call him. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. When I fall from grace, Maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing! Andy! <sighs> Next up, the big finale. 
Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Cloud and Aerith. The final match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Not bad, not bad. Does this mean I don't got to play dead no more? Damn, you two are really something else. I could use that kind of muscle in my gang. So hungry. Man, you proved me wrong. You guys are pretty good. It's the final match. You good to go? I've got a lot of money riding on you two. Win it for me. Ladies and gentlemen, our time together is almost over. Tonight's thrilling tornado cup, filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go. <laughs> we know. We're just as disappointed as you are. But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end. So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the play! Yeah! Come on! Once more, 
The sweethearts who surprised us with upset after spectacular upset. The power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed. The champions of Madam M, Cloud and Eren! Yeah! Come on now! Come on! You can do better than that! And now, five time winners of the Tornado Cup! Murder machines with countless kills to their name! Along with a handful of maimings! The deadly duo that takes up the trash with a vengeance! The electric executioners! Chocobo Sam's champions! Cuddy and Sleepy! Come on! Robots? More like Shinra armor. More like cheating! <laughs> Who will walk away with the one million kill prize? Get ready for a fight guaranteed to go down in history! The final match of the Corneo Cup begins now! Taken this rather well. I was looking forward to a little temper tantrum. You bet it all on a toss. Sometimes you get burned by Lady Luck. Every coin has two sides. You're right, of course. 
even if they are both the same. Later. And now, I believe I have a prize to collect. Sorry. The madam will have to wait. The Don's demanding that we tack on one more match, it seems. What? If they win out, then you get paid in full. Now hold on just a goddamn minute! His call, not mine. <laughs> now that that's over, we can go save Tifa. So we'll head back to Madame M's, get you changed, and then it's off to Corneo's. Right. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but you still have one fight left. What do you mean? The crowd loved your show a little too much. People are placing hefty bets, much heftier than you can possibly imagine. Corneo's going to milk this for as much as he can. Meaning what? You face and defeat Corneo's fighter of choice, and only then will you be declared winners of the tournament. Hey, that wasn't the deal! Don't you think I know that?! Ah! You greedy bastard! Scum-sucking piece of shit-festering asshole! Uh... <sighs> but that's the way it is. Corneo's the one who makes the rules around here. But if you win this match, Corneo will have to accept your victory. And the crowd will make sure he does. So this is the last one? <laughs> I sure hope so. Go on now. That prize money is going to pay for your dress. I've been working here a long time, but this has never happened before. It's gonna be one hell of a match. Watching you guys fight gave me goosebumps. Hope your next match is even better than the last. Ready to kick ass? It's not even about the money anymore, man. I just want you guys to win it all. Show them what you got. Tonight's Corneo Cup has been a spectacle like no other. And we shared your disappointment, ladies and gentlemen, when we told you that it was coming to an end. But nobody felt it more keenly than one time Corneo, who has decided that a bonus match is in order! <laughs> Participating in this match will be this evening's leading lights, the dynamic duo that has crushed all competition thus far! Klaus and Eric! Buried in the bowels of the Coliseum. An unspeakable horse, long in prison, set free tonight for your entertainment! The secret star of Don Cuneo's stellar stable! Enter the Hell House!
just a house. That's no ordinary house. The manifestation of pure evil versus the most badass couple this side of Midgar. Have you ever seen a fight more incredible, more epic? You have not. No, sir, you have not. They'll be singing songs about tonight for generations to come. Keep your eyes glued to the action, ladies and gentlemen. The Cups fight final battle begins now! All the battle is gone! And already I can tell you this, those that will not get the book! This symbol has both the text of the track and the meaning of the name. What can you handle the horror of the hell house? Who will come out on top? Strap yourself in, folks, cause this show is only getting started! Oh, 
sheer persistence in the day. Come on. Will Cloud and Aerith give in to the House of Crushers? Ah, oh no man! Did anyone get the number of that house? Any last words? Well, Could it be? Uh, uh, Wait. <laughs> it's almost disappointing. No. Not yet. Are they strong enough to pull through? Ah! 
that won't give up oh. for the raging fires of hell need nothing but ash and cinder! Let's try that again. You know that had to hurt, folks! Are these moves even legal?
the Hell House. The, <laughs> the brave and beautiful Cloud and Aerith would be champions reduced to food for the beast. We will never forget your sacrifice. Watching you guys fight gave me goosebumps. Hope oh, ready to kick ass? It's not even about the money and show them what you got. Tonight's Corneo Cup has been a spectacle like no other.
cunning little stuffed animals are raining from the sky. That's so cute. We're gonna die. Yeah. Just, just go away. It looks like the hell house. It's going to make one get together. All of the couples have been invited to the story. Whatever. Don't you just want to gather up all those adorable little guys? I'm waiting. Let's go. Disappointing. No, not yet. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, what is happening? What the? Look out! Get him! 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 Down, down, Eric! Okay. Oh, the Hell House is showing us its true nature! Oh, Eric, the cloud has turned!
miraculous escape from our courageous contender! But from the looks of they had a pretty wild time in there! Get up. We have to stop the gas that one that kicks things. Who wants this? They all switch a room. As usual, the hell house is up to the <laughs> Lend me your strength. Stop the bell. Let the wind be the
in some way. What will you do? <laughs> Why didn't you tell me you guys were gonna kick so much ass? Can I get your autographs? With these babies, you can send intruders flying. I guarantee this is the only home protection you'll ever need. Only a few left. Get yours while you can. There you are. I've been looking for you two. So Madam M wanted me to give you a message. She says you guys did pretty damn good and that you should swing by her shop when you're done here. Got it? I was also hoping you might be interested in a few more matches here at the Coliseum. Big events like the Corneo Cup are pretty sporadic, but there's always action if you want to get a piece. on the win. You know, tonight's tournament is going down in history. Watching you win was so inspiring. It made me want to fight, too. Aerith, you were amazing. There's never been a female champion before. Showing up tonight. I know, I know. Wouldn't that be awesome? What a show. I expected a few wins, but that was one thing. Like I told you, Arthur, no soldiers are showing up tonight. I know, I know. Huh? You want to take me up on my offer now? Cool! Then I'll see you down below.
Oh. Hey, been waiting for you. So, what are you in the mood to fight?
Not bad.
not bad. Come back anytime you want to fight.
You're here. Good. I have everything I need to get started. Just one thing before we do. You're the Cloud, right? Cloud the Merc. I'm told you did a wonderful job helping the people of Sector 5. <laughs> you have a very impressive work ethic. It's like they say, good things come to those who work. What goes around, comes around. And in ways that might surprise you. <laughs> I'm gonna put Aerith in the most gorgeous dress you've ever seen. <laughs> It'll be a real jaw-dropper. All right, now that that's out of the way, once you change, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready? Huh? Don't waste my time! If you have things to do, then get out there and do them! Like I said, once you've changed, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready now? All right then, let's get started. Beauty takes a lot of work and preparation. Far more than you'd know. In the meantime, let me see, let me think. There ought to be things you can only do without your friend. Now's your chance to get out and have some fun. <laughs> I can tell you're already beginning to feel at home here. Though being so new to it, I assumed you still wouldn't know how to enjoy yourself properly. <laughs> so I went and had a chat with Sam. He said he'd be happy to help you out. Hey, no one asked you to do that. But there's so much you don't know. This is the perfect opportunity for you to learn the ways of the world and man the hell up. And that's enough of that. Eric, come with me. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the dress. The dress is part of it, sure. But we'll also need to do something about that plain Jane makeup and hairdo. This is gonna take some work. Ouch! Well, I'll see you later, Cloud. Peek, and I'll poke out your eyes. That I told you. No peeking. Mim said you'd be swinging by. Let me see if I've got this straight. You ditched your lady friend and fellow champion to have a boys' night out in Wall Market? Uh. Kidding. If I know the madam, and I do, this was all her idea. I can see why. There's no denying you're skilled with a sword. But when it comes to damn near anything else, I can't help but have my doubts. Well, ain't nothing wrong with that. Then there's nothing wrong with expanding your horizons neither, seeking new experiences. 
Knowing the ways of this here world will help you to better protect her while you're in it. Reckon I got a few solid gigs for you. What do you say? You game? <sighs> yeah. Why not? <laughs> That's the spirit. You have yourself a grand time tonight, Mr. Mark. Welcome. Anything in particular you're looking for? Oh, you must be the Merc I've been hearing about. I need you to help me out with my dad. His drunk ass has been at the bar for hours now. Could you bring him back here? He's probably three sheets in over at Drunkard's. <laughs> Just over there. Wait up, Cloud! Sam caught me up on everything. He said you're gonna go rescue Tifa. And to do that, you're trying to learn all about Walmart. Bro, I know this town like the back of my hand, so I can answer all of your questions. Now, let's go knock this one out. The bar is this way, Cloud. Drunkards, here we come. Uh, are we even allowed here? to walk through the door? Like this is the Drunkard's Den, right? the best place in Ball Market to drink away your problems. It's mostly the same folks every night, so... Whoa, you can't just waltz in there uninvited. Listen, there are rules for this kind of... Hey, wait for me! Sing it loud! Sing it proud! Up for a round of darts? Hey, old dude! Huh? Son, is that you? Did you always look so... moronic? Well, right back at you. Yeah, whatever. We're here to take you back to the store. I'm not going back. Not ever. My life is ruined. It's over. Kill me now. Come on, there's no need to talk like that, old dude. I'll help you out with whatever you need. Really? Oh, thank you, son. See, I made this bet with the Materia Merchant. A sure thing, but then I lost. And so I had no choice but to steal my heart and surrender my precious inspiration. Your precious inspi- who with the what now? Inspiration! <laughs> Without it, there's simply no point in me ever going back to the store. Got it. I mean, I don't got it. But I just need to get your inspiration back, right? Whatever the hell that is. I can't see Leave it to me, old dude. Uh, hey, aren't you gonna go with your friend? <sighs> Leave me alone. I'm nothing but a hollow shell of a man without my inspiration. I ain't no pushover. This is my jam. It speaks to me. Instead of the planets. Just one. The more you eat, the better they get. Fresh chocobo bean popcorn. This place looks kind of creepy, don't you think? Like maybe they practice 
ritual sacrifice, or... Hey, wait for me! So this is it, huh? And what do you two want? Uh, uh, I'm here for the precious inspiration you took from the old dude. Inspiration? Oh, that thing. But I didn't take it. I want it fair and square. It's mine by rights now. Well, that's true. But I tell you what. I'll consider giving it back in exchange for it. A favor. Uh, what you need? Something only real men can deliver. Uh. I need you to go and get me something from the vending machine at the end. You know what. You know. No, I don't think I... Wait. The sauce. The sauce? Stop saying the sauce. Anyway, good luck. I'd go myself, but long story short, I'm not allowed inside anymore. Anyway, shoo, shoo. 